Hey guys, it's Lori. I'm still up here at my dad's. I'm actually sitting at a Walmart right now. I just got done picking up some stuff for just to restock his fridge. And uh, I thought I would just show you what I got. So I'll have a little Walmart haul. But first I wanna give you a quick update on dad. Um, he's, he's doing better than he was yesterday. Um, the hospice nurse came last night and I mean, there wasn't much she could do. I mean, she checked him out and she doesn't hear any fluid in his lungs or anything, but um, they did start him on his oxygen. So he's got an oxygen thing, tank, and he has to have it in his nose and it's like, he it irritates the crap out of him. But we did get him out of the house for a few minutes, a little while today. That was a challenge. That was a huge challenge, but he wanted to go to the bank and get some things straightened out. I was able to get some forms for power of attorney at Staples. The bank refused to notarize it because it wasn't from a lawyer. <sighs> that whole thing is just so stinking frustrating. So I'm gonna be here for a couple more days. So Monday morning, I am gonna go knocking on doors or <laughs> I'm going to go physically go to the attorney's office and say, hey, what is up? We just want this form. Help us out here. You know, anyway, in the will, they do have forms for the last will and testament at Staples as well. But I didn't get it because they, they didn't have any left at all. And they're like 40 bucks. It's like, I'm kind of glad I didn't because it would have been a waste of money because the bank probably wouldn't have notarized it anyways. So anyhow, let's go on with what I got for my dad's house. I got him some more whipped cream. He, ha he has to eat. He is not wanting to eat at all, at all. And he's having a really hard time just getting the spoon to his mouth and opening his mouth and getting it in there. So he doesn't want help. He doesn't want fed. You know what I'm saying? So anyways... They're recommending soft foods as much as possible. I got him some whipped cream because he's been eating a lot of Jello, and he only has one Jello left. So I got him some of these Jello parfait because he's been eating Jello with lots of whipped cream. He likes lots of whipped cream on it. So this has whipped cream in it, and I got some more for on top. He has some whipped cream at home, but it's getting low, so I wanted to get him some more. And also, I got him some spreadable butter, the whipped butter. And I also got some stick butter because that was actually on a grocery list. My cousin, his cousin had left a list and stick butter was one of the things that she had on the list. She actually went home for a few days and I'm going to stay for a few days. My brother's there right now along with his daughter, my niece. They're both there with him right now. So I said, you know what, I'm going to take off. I'm just going to go, go shopping, get some groceries here. Dad's been asking for vanilla ice cream, so he'll eat a little bit of this. He doesn't eat much at a time, period. So... Um, I also got him some of this butterscotch pudding. He loves butterscotch pudding, so I thought I would get him some of this. The neighbor actually just brought over some homemade banana pudding for him, so hopefully he'll eat that. He's not the biggest fan of banana, but I think he'll like the pudding. We'll see. Um, he's also only got a couple slices of his bread left. This is his favorite. It's the Aunt Millie's potato bread. That's what he likes, so yep, that's what I got him. And I got a little packet of these buttery mashed potatoes. I can make him some of these. He doesn't love instant potatoes, but yeah, that might go down smooth for him. I also got a small bag of potatoes and I thought I would cut these up real small and make him a little pan of potato soup. So with rivels, does anybody know what rivels are? Because that's how we always made it at home and he loves potato soup with rivels. And if I make the rivels really small, I think he can eat that. And I know he likes it. So I can make a little pan of that. Where's that bread? I don't want to smash it. Okay. But I could make him a little pan of that. And I think that'll be good. Rivels are just eggs and flour. It's kind of like a noodle ball. It's a noodle ball. That's what it is. But he likes those. And also some more smoky links. I got him these before and they're gone. So somebody ate them. I don't know if it was him or, or my cousin and his lady friend. I don't know. I don't care. Either way, somebody ate them. So also, I last time I was there, I got some turkey lunch meat as well as some ham lunch meat and that's all gone too so somebody ate it somebody liked it 
and um the other let's see everything else i got was stuff that i can have okay for my round i didn't inject today and i'm probably not going to i'm probably just going to call the round to be honest because this is just too much i don't know what's going on i mean i just i'm not going to try to stay on on hcg while i'm doing all this i'm just going to go straight into just maintaining I lost somewhere around 11 and a half, 12 pounds, something like that. I'm not positive, you guys. I'd have to go home and look. But um, 11 pounds for sure. Probably a little bit more than that. I have no idea what, what this morning scale would have said because I'm not home. So anyway, I'm just going off the round and that's that. Um, yeah, but I am going to stay. I am going to stay low carb. And I picked up this bag of vegetable medley, broccoli, carrots, and cauliflower. And I'm just gonna separate these on a tray along with some of this dill dip because my dad's sister and another cousin are coming today. And so we're gonna have people in the house. I at least wanna be able to set out a veggie tray for them to snack on. They're, they're driving like four or five hours. So they probably stopped somewhere and ate, but I still wanna have something for them to munch on. I also grabbed some cottage cheese. Dad likes cottage cheese and I can have this too. Daisy, great ingredients. So there's that. I also picked up a, just a can of green beans because I don't know, maybe I'll want some green beans. Maybe he'll want some. <laughs> and I did get myself some half and half. I don't have any half and half there at all. So I just grabbed it and I grabbed some shredded mozzarella and some shredded ch sharp cheddar. He does have some of this in his fridge, but there's just a few little tiny pieces and they kind of smell like feet. <laughs> it smells funky. So we got some new shredded cheddar. I also grabbed some romaine lettuce because I want salads. I want salads. I grabbed a package of ground chuck. I'm going to make up some burgers and I can put those on lettuce or I can use these wraps. I went ahead and grabbed some low carb wraps. I probably shouldn't be having these just yet, but you know what? I want that potato bread. I want the potato bread. So I'm going to have this instead. And that's the way that's going to be. I grabbed a little package of pepperoni for myself. And with the mozzarella cheese, as well as this pizza sauce, little thing of pizza sauce, it's got good ingredients, no sugar, no sugar added to it. So I'll probably make some skillet pizzas for myself. And I also went ahead and grabbed some spring mix. He's, he's not gonna eat a salad, I'm sure of that, because he just, he can't chew that much. It wears him out. So yeah, but I'll eat salads and whoever else is there can have salads. I also grabbed myself a bag of these Max barbecue pork rinds, not the best choice. These don't have the best ingredients, but you know what? It's the way it's going right now. So <laughs> it's the way it's going to be. Okay. That's something for me to snack on besides the several bags of potato chips that are on top of his refrigerator right now. So yeah. Okay. Um, yeah, that's everything guys. So I'm going to try to edit this in my iMovie app and see how it works. And I'll get this uploaded and I just want to give you an update, show you what I got. So yeah. Thanks so much for all your kind words, all your prayers, all your thoughts, all your love. I appreciate you so much. I mean that from the bottom of my heart. Keep them coming if you don't mind. We'll take them. We'll take them. Okay, guys. Thanks again. And I'll see you in the next video.